Here's a quick example of how to apply some of the things that you may have learned. I'm trying to find the probability from a normal model. Let's take a look at our example. The time, <clears throat> excuse me, the time per workout an athlete uses a stair climber is normally distributed with a mean of 20 minutes and a standard deviation of five minutes. An athlete is chosen at random. Find the probability that the athlete uses the stair climber for less than 17 minutes. So what I'm trying to do is find the probability that my random variable X is less than 17. On my normal model, the mean is always in the middle, so 20 minutes is right here, and I'm concerned with 17 minutes. In fact, I want to know what is the probability that it's less than 17 minutes. Well, <clears throat> what I really want to do here is find the area, there's a bell right there, I'll let that go. Um, I want to find the area of this shaded region right here, less than 17 minutes. So um, what I really want to do is I want to change this 17 minutes into a z-score. There's a way that you could find this area without changing it into a z-score, but it's really easier to just use z-scores because eventually you're going to use this all the time anyway. So 17 is my x. Mu is my mean, which is 20 minutes, and sigma down below is my standard deviation, which is 5. When you do the math here, that's negative 3 over 5, which is the same as negative 0.6. So 17 as a z-score is equal to negative 0.6. Now it's time to go to my calculator, and I'm going to go second vars, and number two is normal CDF. I'm using a normal model. And I want to go from negative 99, which is my left-hand boundary, to my right-hand boundary, which is negative 0.6. When I hit Enter, the calculator will give me the probability that I'm looking for. I'll highlight it here, 0.274. So since this is a word problem, I would want to give my answer in a complete sentence. I'm not going to write it down. I'm just going to say it. Um, basically, what I do is just take the question and change it into a sentence. Instead of find the probability, I'm going to say the probability that the athlete uses the stair climber for less than 17 minutes is about 27.4%. So I hope this helps, and hopefully you will have fun in your stats class.